Hi everyone, welcome to Crochet for Life. In this video, I'm going to share with you how to crochet this so beautiful and really easy baby hat with the four different size. This baby hat is so beautiful and really easy to make and so comfortable for babies. I made this baby hat for the baby boy. If you want to make the baby girl, you just need to change the color. This pattern have only two rows to repeat. It's really easy to make. Even beginners can make too. I'm going to give you all details step by step. I really love this pattern. I hope you will love too. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. If you're new for my channel, don't forget to join with my thousand of subscribers by clicking this subscribe button and the bell icon. Okay, before I start the tutorial, I'm going to show you my finished set. I made this baby mitten using my basic mitten video. You can get in the 8 different size. And these socks, you can get the 5 different size. I'm going to give you this all link in the description down below. In this video, I'm going to share with you five, sorry, 4 different size with this same pattern. Newborn 0 to 3, 3 to 6 and 6 to 12 month. And I'm going to show you how to make this two color pom pom. I'm using this pattern to make this baby hat. This baby blanket is so comfortable for baby and really easy to make. Only two rows to repeat. It's really nice size. I made this baby set for the baby boy. If you want to make the baby girl, you just need to change the color. You can use the pink with the white. I'm going to give you this all link in the description down below. I'm using the same pattern to make this baby hat. I'm using two colors to make this baby hat. Main color is the white and second color is the blue. Then I'm using white and a blue color yarn this hat main color is the white second color is the blue this yarn is double netting yarn this yarn recommend hook is four this yarn will have 100 gram 330 meters we need little bit yarn to make this baby hat if you want to make this full set with the this hat and a blanket two socks and two mitten you need three main color that means three white color yarn ball and two second color two blue color yarn ball only for this hat little bit yarn i'm using four millimeter crochet hook to make this baby hat i'm gonna use the same hook to make the four different size baby hat you can see this pattern is so beautiful first i'm using main color main color is the white to begin i'm gonna start zero to three month size and i'm gonna give you the whole detail as well slip knot And a chain one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 24, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56. This 56 chain for the newborn size. 
then mean early born size 0 to 3 month size I'm gonna make 0 to 3 month size then I gonna make 60 chain 57 58 59 60 this 60 chain for the new uh, sorry 0 to 3 month size 0 to 3 month we need 60 chain 3 to 6 month 3 to 6 month we need 64 chain 6 to 12 month we need 68 chain this the all for different size and the plus 2 chain 61 62 now I have a 62 chain I'm gonna use this back loop turn this chain to the back side I skip first three chain into the fourth chain I skip first one two three chain into the fourth chain one double crochet again into the next chain one double crochet into the next chain one double crochet this first three chain is the first double crochet now I have one two three four we have to make into each chain one double crochet this first row is going into each chain one double crochet follow this pattern all the way to this first row i'm going to show you end of this first row now i'm nearly finished this first row i made into each chain one double crochet into this last chain last double crochet now i finished first row into each chain one double crochet this one for 0 to 3 month size. Then I have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. 60 double crochet. This 60 double crochet for the 0 to 3 month size. Next I am going to join this last and the first double crochet together. I am using yarn needle to join this first and last double crochet together. It's like a ring. This first round I have a 60 double crochet. New bone size you need 56 double crochet. 0 to 3 60 double crochet 3 to 6 64 double crochet 6 to 12 68 double crochet when you join the first and last double crochet it's coming like this next i gonna finish this first row join with the first third chain using by slip stitch this is the first round this first round have a 60 double crochet. Next I'm going to start the round 2. Round 2 start with the chain 3. 1, 2, 3. Next into this first double crochet is coming front force double crochet. Front force double crochet into the next double crochet. Back force double crochet. Again into the next double crochet. Front force double crochet. Into the next back force double crochet. Again front force double crochet. Into the next double crochet is coming back force double crochet. This round 2 is going front force and back force double crochet. Follow this pattern all around to this round 2. Now I am nearly finished this round 2. Back force double crochet. Finish with the front force double crochet. 
this first three chain is going to the back force double crochet join with the first third chain using by slip stitch now I'm finished two round next round round three start with the chain three one two three this first three chain is going to back force double crochet into the next front force double crochet to front force double crochet into the back force double crochet back force double crochet again into the front force double crochet to front force double crochet back force double crochet to back force double crochet this round three is going front force double crochet to front force double crochet back force double crochet to back force double crochet follow this pattern all around to this round three i'm going to show you end of this round three now i'm nearly finished this round three front force and back force double crochet into this last double crochet front force double crochet this first three chain is going to the back force double crochet join with the first third chain using by slip stitch now i have finished three round round four start with the chain three one two three into this front force double crochet to front force double crochet into this back force double crochet to back force double crochet this round four is going same way front force double crochet to front force double crochet back force double crochet to back force double crochet follow this pattern all around to this round four i'm going to show you end of this round four now I'm um, nearly finished this round four. Back force double crochet. Finish with the front force double crochet. Go through the first third chain. Now I'm gonna chain the color. Then I'm gonna hold this white color yarn to behind like this. I'm using blue color yarn now. Pull this blue color yarn through this two loop. We don't want to cut the yarn. I'm going to tie this white color yarn. Now I have a blue color on a hook. Chain 1. I'm going to start this pattern. This pattern is coming back side to the front side. And this the right way. And this the back side. We are using this stitch on the back side. This the basic four round. Now I'm going to start the pattern. Turn your work other side. This the right side. This side is inside. Into the next double crochet. Single crochet. Into the next double crochet, I'm going to use modern double crochet. Wrap the yarn, go through this double crochet and pull it up. Now I have three loops and a hook. Release one loop. Now I have again three loops and a hook. Release next two loops. Now I have two loops and a hook. Again, release these two loops. This is the modern double crochet. Into the next double crochet, again single crochet. You can see this back side, this stitch is coming, little bit small bubble. Again into the next double crochet, modern double crochet. Go through this double crochet and pull this yarn. Three loops on a hook. Release one loop, again release two loops, again two. This double crochet a little bit longer than normal double crochet. Into the next single crochet. Again into the next double crochet, modern double crochet. 
into the next double crochet single crochet again into the next double crochet modern double crochet into the next double crochet single crochet again modern double crochet single crochet this the right side you can see small bubble in this side this pattern is going one modern double crochet into the next double crochet to one single crochet follow this pattern all around to this round one i'm going to show you end of this round one now i'm nearly finished this round one for this pattern modern double crochet single crochet this round i start with the single crochet then i have to finish with the modern double crochet then is complete this round into this first chain last modern double crochet go through to this first single crochet Now we are going to change this color. Go through this single crochet. Slip stitch. This time I pull it this white color yarn through this two loop. And tie this blue color yarn. This the right side. Next round round 2 for this pattern i start with the chain 3 1 2 3 turn your work other side this the right side this the 0 to 3 month size then i have a 1 2 3 4 5 10 15 20 25 26 27 28 29 30 30 bubble for this 0 to 3 month size next round 2 start with the chain 3 into this modern double crochet top into this double crochet top double crochet again into the next single crochet one double crochet into the modern double crochet one double crochet into this single crochet one double crochet this round is going into each stitch one double crochet into this single crochet one double crochet follow this pattern all around to this round two i'm going to show you end of this round two now i'm nearly finished this round two i made into each stitch one double crochet now i finished round two Round 2, I have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. 60 double crochet. This 60 double crochet for the round two next i'm gonna change the color it's easy to you hold the white color yarn for the front side and blue color yarn for the back side then in easy to change the color go through the first third chain pull this blue color yarn through this two loop 
Now you can see this white color for the front side and blue color for the back side. I have a blue color on my hook now. Round 3 start with the chain 1. Turn your work other side. Into the first double crochet. This is the first double crochet. Into this first double crochet. Single crochet. Into the next double crochet. Modern double crochet. I hope you know how to make this modern double crochet now. First pass the first loop and next two loop. Again next two loop. Into the next single crochet. Again modern double crochet. You can't use the treble crochet. When you use the treble crochet is coming long stitch. Again modern double crochet. Single crochet again, modern double crochet, single crochet. Follow this pattern all around to this round three. I'm gonna show you end of this round three. Now I'm nearly finished this round three. Single crochet. Double crochet, single crochet, finish with the modern double crochet, go through this first chain, modern double crochet, I start with a single crochet, then I'm going to finish with the modern double crochet, go through this single crochet, now I'm going to change the color. I'm going to hold this blue color yarn to inside. I'm going to pull this white color yarn through this two loop. Now I have a white color yarn on my hook. Next round, start with the chain three. One, two, three. Turn your work other side. Now you can see I'm finished one, two, three round. This Pattern have only two rows to repeat. Round four is going same like a round two. Start with the chain three. Next is going into each stitch one double crochet. This pattern is really easy. Only two rows to repeat. This round is going into each stitch one double crochet. Into this modern double crochet, one double crochet, and into this single crochet, one double crochet. End of this round, we need 60 double crochet again. Follow this pattern all around to this round. I'm gonna show you end of this round. Now I'm nearly finished round four. I made into each stitch one double crochet. Now I have a 60 double crochet again. I'm going to hold this white color yarn to the front side. And I'm going to pull this blue color yarn through this third chain. And this loop. Now I have a blue color on my hook. Next round, start with the chain 1. Turn your work other side. into next double crochet single crochet into the next double crochet modern double crochet again single crochet into the next modern double crochet again single crochet i hope you get this pattern now it's really easy only two rows to repeat this one for 0 to 3 month size. Then we have a 60 double crochet. Continue this 60 double crochet with your head size. This one 0 to 3 month size. Then we need all together 11 round. 11 round after I'm going to reduce the stitch. When you finish the 11 round you can get the 6 round with the blue 
color line different size have a different round i'm going to give you all detail after 11 round i'm going to show you how to reduce the stitch continue with this pattern only two rows to repeat i'm going to show you end of the round 11 this pattern is going modern double crochet single crochet modern double crochet now i'm nearly finished round 11 modern double crochet single crochet finish with the modern double crochet Go through the single crochet, pull the white color yarn through this two loop, tie this blue color yarn. Next round, start with the chain three, turn your work other side. Now I made the eleven round, you can see in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. When you finish the 11 round, you can get the 6 blue color line. This is the first 4 round. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 round. This size for the 0 to 3 month size. Newborn size, we need all together 9 rows. Then it's coming 5 blue line. 3 to 6. 13 round then is coming 7 blue line 6 to 12 or together 15 round then is coming 8 blue round that's the all four different size then is coming newborn 5 line 0 to 3 6 line 3 to 6 7 line 6 to 12 8 line with this blue color now i have all together 11 round this 11 round for the 0 to 3 month size. Next 3 round is going same for the all different size. Start with the chain 3 into this modern double crochet. Double crochet, last loop on a hook. Again into this single crochet to double crochet, last loop on a hook. Now I have a 3 loops on a hook. Go through these 3 loops, make 1 stitch. Again into this model double crochet to one double crochet, last loop on a hook, single crochet to double crochet, last loop on a hook, go through this all loop, make one stitch. This round is going two stitch together, again modern double crochet to double crochet, last loop on a hook, single crochet to double crochet, last loop on a hook, go through this all loops make one stitch i hope you will get it this one is going two stitch together follow this pattern all around to this round 12 i'm going to show you end of this round 12 now i'm nearly finished round 12 double crochet last loop on a hook double crochet last loop on a hook go through this all loop into this last modern double crochet to double crochet last loop on a hook go through this first third chain and slip stitch this time i'm gonna change the color i'm gonna pull this blue color yarn through this all loop now i have a blue color on my hook turn your work other side into the first stitch single crochet into the next stitch modern double crochet again into the next stitch single crochet you know this pattern you can continue this pattern all around to this round it's going modern double crochet into the next single crochet again modern double crochet 
follow this pattern all around to this round I'm gonna show you end of this round 13 now I'm nearly finished round 13 single crochet finished with the modern double crochet I start with the single crochet and finish with the modern double crochet now I have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 round with the blue color yarn. Go through this single crochet. Pull this both color yarn. I'm going to cut this blue color yarn now. Pull this both color yarn with the chain one and tie this blue color yarn I have a one chain with the white color yarn I'm gonna add two more chain now I have a three chain for the round 14 I have a seven round with the blue color yarn now I'm gonna make the last round round 14 into this modern double crochet to one double crochet last loop on a hook into this single crochet double crochet last loop on a hook make one stitch again into the next modern double crochet to double crochet last loop on a hook single crochet double crochet last loop on a hook go through this all loops now I have a two stitch three four Four, five. This round is going two stitch together. Six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen and a fifteen. Go through the first third chain, last stitch, fifteen. Now I finish last round. You can see I'm start with the sixty double crochet. I finish with the fifty stitch. Now I'm using yarn needle to close this top. First, I'm going to tie this yarn. This one for 0 to 3 month size. I have altogether 14 round. When you finish the 14 round, you can get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 blue color round. The 6 round I made with the same number of stitch and last 3 round reduce stitch. Now I'm going to close this top. I'm going to pass this needle through this each stitch like this. Next I'm going to show you how to make the true color pom pom for this hat. I hope you will love this hat. When you finish this hat, don't forget to share with me in our Facebook group. I give you all link in the description down below. And the, you can get this all yarn detail in the description too. Now I am finished passing this needle all through this stitch. I am going to tie this all stitch together now. I am going to pull this yarn like 
these and tied this all is stitched together and tied this yarn using one knot next you can hide this yarn or you can use the same yarn to tie the pom pom it's coming like this it's so beautiful and really easy to make next i'm going to show you how to make the two color pom pom for this hat in my previous video i show how to make the pom pom in this video i'm going to show you how to use two color for the pom pom I'm using the same yarn to tie the at the pom pom. This size for zero to three month size. I have all together fourteen round. Next, I'm using this five point five millimeter crochet hook. First, I'm using white sorry blue color yarn. First round going with the blue color yarn. Now I finish first round. Second round is I'm using white color yarn. Now I finish second round with the white color yarn. Again I'm going to use one more round with the blue color yarn. That's how I made the two color pom pom. You can see in a pom pom video how to make the pom pom without this pom pom maker i give you link in a description down below you can see it's coming it's so beautiful pom pom i'm gonna add this pom pom for this hat top you can see it's so beautiful and really easy to make I'm going to add this pom pom for this top. When you finish this hat and the this matching set, don't forget to share with me in our Facebook group. I give you link in the description down below. I'm going to pull this yarn to the inside and I'm going to tie this pom pom in inside to this hat. When you tie this pom pom in inside, you can pull this yarn to the outside and cut the same size to this pom pom. Then you can get the beautiful finishing like this. And I'm going to give you the same matching cardigan for this matching set. It's really easy to make. You can make this baby hat within 20 to 30 minutes. It's really easy to make. This size for 0 to 3 months size. You know how to make the newborn to 12 months now. This much yarn left when you use the full set for the blanket and a card, uh, sorry, uh, socks and a mitten. I hope you will love this video. If you like this video, please thumbs up and share and comment down below. See you again with another video.